one of our area's most recognizable and beloved authors has a new book out just in time for Christmas. Patrick McManus brings back reader favorite Sheriff Bo Tully of Blight County, Idaho to solve the case of the Huckleberry murders. Let me read to you. The screams were moving toward him. He could tell they came from women, no doubt Huckleberry pickers, who had run into a bear. The bear was probably racing for his life over the top of the mountain. The ladies came around a curve in the road and were now huffing and puffing toward him. Boy, this sounds like our kind of book. Joining <laughs> me tonight is Patrick McManus, and we love it when you stop by. Thank you so oh, much for being here. Nice to be here, Chris. And a brand new book, very exciting, the fourth book in the series uh, with Sheriff Bo Tully. Tell us about the characters who are coming back this time. Uh, the characters, uh, Bo's secretary, Daisy, uh, is, uh, is back, and... Um, uh, the, and the detectives, various detectives are, are all there, and Lurch, the uh -huh. crime scene guy. So um, it has all the bits and pieces of the usual TV mystery. <laughs> well, we love your, your books because your, your characters are so rich and they feel like our neighbors here in the Northwest. Well, they are. They're very Idahonian. Yeah, <laughs> that's why I think why we love them so much. But, but you have obviously worldwide acclaim, so other people enjoy them too. Which characters do you most closely identify with? A uh, bow. Uh, Bo Tully, the hero, naturally. Of course. <laughs> we share a lot of the same values and, and talents and so on. Uh, and this is him right here on the cover, yes. is that correct? He's a right. handsome fellow, too, just like you. Well, I thought I was a little handsomer well, than that. Well, you might, you might be right there. <laughs> now, Sheriff Tully has solved some pretty grisly crimes, but you tell stories very differently than what you would find in TV and movies these I days. I tried not to make them too graphic uh, or uh, graphic at all. And uh, I have some fairly elderly uh, people. Uh, this, uh, I just got a letter, and the lady said, uh, Pat, I have fallen in love with Bo Tully. Oh. <laughs> I'm 73 years old. So. <laughs> well, he's irresistible. I can understand why. Well, even though everything is fictional, you were able to throw in some realities from today, the slumping economy and, and some issues about huckleberry pickers. Oh, yes. Yes, indeed. And... A and uh, um, there's quite a bit of discussion about huckleberry pickers, and it'd be useful to okay, North excellent. Idahonians, you know. Excellent. Well, if you would like a copy of the Huckleberry Murders and have it signed by Mr. McManus, he'll be reading and signing at Andy's Bookstore in downtown Spokane Wednesday night at 7 p.m. I think this would make a great... Christmas present. Oh, I do too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I'm going to pick up a few copies and thank you so much for being here. You just finished your fifth book, so we'll be the, you'll be back book, in a year. My to wife talk is about home it. finishing it at this moment. Okay, so. <laughs> thank you so much.